I didn't think originally we would have a score in the movie, mainly because there's so much music already going on. When we met, I told him, I realized this isn't a composer's movie, and he told me he really wanted to feature the music. I just thought about it some more, and especially when you're not editing, the sound design process becomes the only way to be creative in post-production. So that was really all we had to finish telling the story. I'm always looking for that one moment, what's the idea of the film? And Samson is this sort of lost soul. There's one scene in act three where he leaves the strip club and he walks down the street and into a bar. To me, that was sort of the moment. And it's like Samson's little theme where we're out there with him alone. It's just him, us, and the score. I said, that's the cue I have to write first, because if I can write that cue, the rest will start to make sense when Samson is in a sort of intense situation or if he's in a dangerous situation, I know who he is and I can say something there. So that was kind of our starting point. There are only five cuts and they're all, you know, you stop, you move on to the next thing. So there were a couple of moments where I would find the shift in the story. That to me is sort of a cut in a way. music then puts these breakpoints where you say, okay, now we're done with one idea narratively and we're moving into another. It fits together like a puzzle and I really enjoy that. And I was really excited to be able to make some strong statements in the music. <laughs>